Namaste friends, welcome to Siddhi Yoga. I am Tara and today we are in our beginner yoga journey day 22. So get ready, prepare your yoga mat, get your comfy clothes on and let's get started. Welcome back friends. For today's practice, you are going to require your yoga mat as usual. But for today, you are also going to require the yoga strap and also wall. If the wall is not close to you or not sufficient wall is around you, then don't worry. You can find a chair instead of the wall. I will let you know uh, when and where, how you are going to use the chair. If you are planning of doing this sequence at the beach, then also don't worry because the variation we are going to do the wall, it's very close to extended child pose. So instead of using a wall or chair support, you can do extended child pose on your yoga mat. So let's start the practice. Our today's practice starting with a standing position. So stand with feet hip width distance apart. Roll your shoulders back and down, palm faced forward. Close your eyes and connect to your breath. Feel the flow of your breath into your nostrils, into the tip of your nostrils. Feel the sensation of the breath. Allow your body, breath and mind to relax. Tell yourself that I am preparing myself for this class, for this practice, preparing physically and mentally. Let go of the past, do not worry about the future, stay in the present, stay connected to yourself. Now slowly open your eyes. Alright, get ready. So from here just uh, move your knees just to feel the presence yourself on the mat. And relaxing your arms and shoulder, you can swing your arms and shoulder here. Deep breathe in and deep breathe out. All right. Now, standing with the feet hip width distance apart, moving your arms forward into the shoulder level, palm face down. Keep your all fingers together. Active your biceps and triceps. And then from here, inhale, twist your arm, turning your palm to face up. Exhale, bending your elbow. Touch the back of your shoulder and opening your elbows to the side. Now moving your elbows in, inhale, opening your elbow, straightening your elbow here. Keep the fingers together, biceps and triceps are active, exhaling, turning your palm face down. Continue the practice, inhaling, palm facing up, exhaling, bending your elbow, open your elbow to the side, in, forward, exhale down. So move your arms forward into the shoulder level. All fingers are together. Keep them tight. Also tighten your biceps and triceps. Activate them. Inhale, turning your palm to face up. Exhale, bending your elbow, touch the back of the shoulder. Then opening your elbows to the side. Elbows in. Inhale, straightening your elbow. Keep your arms active. Exhale, turning your palm to face down. So the time your elbow is straight, try to engage your arm as much as possible. When your elbow bends, the engagement is not that much because your biceps is contracting and the triceps is lengthening. So you cannot engage them at the same time because the muscle movement has changed. But still you want to keep your position more and more active as much as possible to get the maximum benefit. So very again, inhale, palm facing up. Exhale, touch the back of your shoulder, elbows out to the side, open your chest, elbows in, inhale, elbows straight, exhale, palm face down. Continue, inhale, palm facing up, exhale, bend your elbow, open them to the side, then in, inhale, exhale, palm face down, inhale, palm facing up, exhale, bend your elbow, elbow to the side, in, Inhale, straightening your elbow, 
exhale, palm face down. Now, arms down, rolling your shoulders back and relax them. Shake your arms and your shoulders, shake them nicely. All right, now open your arms to the side, shoulder level. From here, start rotating your arms, both arms in four directions with a smaller rotation. Do not make this rotation bigger, just a smaller, tiny rotation in four directions. Keep rotating and smiling. All right, now reverse the rotation. Keep rotating. Now arms down and relax the shoulders. You want to loosen the shoulders to relax them. If you feel to shake, you can shake your shoulders quickly to relax them. Now the next practice, single arm rotation. How we are going to do is move your left palm closer to your right shoulder so we can feel the movement of the shoulder to connect more. We are placing the left palm on top of to the right shoulder and then we are start rotating the right shoulder in four direction slow easy rotation but the rotation this time is bigger keep rotating in four direction all right now from here reverse the rotation and relax the right arm let's do with the left forward rotation slow easy rotation during the rotation try keeping your elbow straight but arm should be relaxed no activation in your muscles now reverse If your knee or ankles get tired by standing, you can micro bend your knees to release the pressure from your knee and ankle. And now relax. Relaxing your shoulders nicely. We are moving towards the next practice. Have your both fingers on top of your shoulders, chest open, breathe in here. With exhalation, lifting your elbows up and then together. Inhale, chest open. Exhale, chest close. Inhale, chest open. Exhale, close. Two more. Inhale, open. Exhale, close. Inhale, open. Exhale, close. Let's do other way around. Inhale, open. Exhale, close. Inhale, open. Exhale, close. Inhale, open. Exhale, close. Continue. Inhale, open. Exhale, close. Inhale, exhale, two more, inhale, exhale, inhale, and exhale. Now release your arms, relaxing your shoulders again. The next practice is one of the powerful shoulder opening and strengthening practice. So let's do the practice. For the practice, you are moving your both arms forward and they are coming close to each other palm face down. Let me demonstrate the practice first. So from here, I'm going to throw my left hands over my head, the left elbow will bend and I'm going to throw my right hands to the back from the bottom, elbow is straight and then they are coming and meeting together and then I'm switching. While I'm doing this movement, I'm also combining my breath with my arm movement. Now the breath is inhaling here. With exhalation, I'm going to throw my arms back, inhaling center, exhaling, throwing back, which looks like this. And during the practice, so your arms should be completely relaxed during the movement. Keep the shoulders loosened. So let's start the practice. Arms forward, shoulders down, inhale and start.
Very good. Continue moving. You got this. Few more. And come back. Relaxing your arms and relaxing your shoulders. Now, have your hands on your hip and start rotating your hips in clockwise direction. The rotation can be smaller if you have any issues connected with your lower back. If you feel okay with your lower back, then you can start making your rotation more and more bigger. Keep breathing. While you're rotating, you can also combine your breath with the movement. Inhale as you arch your back. Exhale as you lean forward. Now change the rotation direction. Rotate other way around. Give a nice warming up rotation movement from your hip. Very good. Returning back to the center. Breathe in here. As you exhale, slowly lean forward. Allow your arms to go down. Now let's stretch the shoulders by moving your right arm down. Move, stretch your right shoulder down, 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 down. And now release. And then switch the side. You are stretching your left shoulder down, down, down. You are turning your left side and twisting slightly to stretch. Good. Continue. Do with your right now and with your left. Now with right and with your left. Now hold your biceps, relaxing your head and your neck, arms and your shoulders and swing side to side. All right, back to the center, relaxing your arms again, open your arms, inhale, press the base, bend your knees and slowly lifting your spine up with a rounded back through your vertebra to vertebra, coming all the way up to the standard. Very good. Now for the next practice, lifting your arms up, bending your right elbow. Try to hold your left deltoid muscles or you can just touch the shoulder and then bending your left elbow. The same you do with your left. Try to touch your shoulder or you can hold your deltoid. Inhale, lengthening your torso up. Open your feet some more. Exhale, lean your body towards your right. If you have weak back, then do your breathing opposite. Inhale, lean towards your right. Exhaling, coming up. Inhale, lean towards your left. Exhaling, coming up. So here you can switch your breath according to your body condition. So let's start again. Inhaling. I'm exhaling for the side. You can inhale for the side. So whichever you like, you can follow your breath. Keep moving from right to left and left to right. The movement should be slow and easy. You're giving a lateral extension for the core and for the spine. All right. After you complete your left, come up, releasing your arms down, rolling your shoulders back and relax them. Move your feet in. Now for the next practice, we are going to use the strap. Pick up your strap. We are going to require about two and a half to three feet distance. So this strap is quite long. I'm going to wrap the strap in my one hand. Now we leave about two and a half to three feet. So which is this much long, longer than your yoga mat. 
but this length always adjustable according to your shoulder flexibility you can make it shorter you can make it longer and we are going to do the full rotation movement with the arms and the shoulder let me show you so for this practice you are stretching your arms to the side to keep the strap straight inhaling moving your both arms towards your right left elbow bend right elbow straight and lifting your left arm over your head and then moving your arms all the way to the back and down then you switch your arms bending your right elbow left elbow straight and moving your arms forward so this is how it looks arms goes back down then moves up and moves forward the rotation begins from the right to the back and from the back to the left and the breathing happens like this inhale exhale forward inhale exhale forward i guess you understand already so let's start the practice inhale moving your arms back from your right exhaling forward inhale right exhaling forward from the left continue rotating remember the practice should be easy and comfortable for your arms for your shoulders especially you can always adjust the length of the strap you can make it longer or shorter according to your shoulder flexibility okay let's reverse the rotation now moving your arms back from your left moving forward from the right and left back forward from your right inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale last one inhale and exhale relaxing your arms and the shoulder so we don't need strap anymore so have the strap next to your mat in case you're going to require you can have the strap close to you for the next practice we are going to go closer to the wall let me show you the practice with the wall and then i will tell you how you can use the chair or using a mat so for the wall practice you will get already idea after i will do the practice it's a shoulder opening movement your palms are wider than your shoulder when you place your palms your fingers are turning out to the side so this is the beginning preparation and then you will be walking your feet back until your elbow becomes straight your palms are pressed on the wall lengthening your arms stretch your this part of your arms the closer to your armpit is stretching to the back then you can only unlock your joint from your uh, from your shoulder otherwise you may feel pinching sensation during your shoulder opening so you press the wall shift your buttocks to the back pushing your buttocks back stretch from your armpit and then open your chest your biceps are rolling out so this is how it looks with the wall similar you can do with a chair you can have the chair in front of you and then place your hands on top of to the chair the backrest of the chair and then opening your chest while you are using the chair becomes more easier but less progressive you get the more progress uh, uh, while you are using the wall the third one is the using a yoga mat you can get into extended child pose position as uttit balasan then from here you are extending your palms forward your palms are wider than your shoulder try moving your chest down as far as possible then chin down if it's not possible to bring the chin down then forehead down so you can choose any of one option and get into the pose so let's get it together prepare your palm feet move back inhale and ex Exhale, lengthen the spine, open the chest, enjoy the stretch in your arms and your shoulder. Breathe in and breathe out. Remember, do not tilt your pelvis forward. Your pelvis should stay tucked in, belly button in. Keep breathing. nice now inhale slowly come up and release your pose 
so after doing this wall shoulder opening or you have done your chair or the yoga mat shoulder opening we are ready to go much more further into our practice so get ready for the next part your feet is hip width distance apart feet should be facing forward hands to the hip bending your knees releasing your left hands down left shoulder should be relaxed arm should be completely relaxed and then from here inhale you are swinging your left arm towards your right rolling your buttocks under tuck the tailbone in lift the torso up lifting your heart up 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 towards the sky move your arm back arching your back and then bending your knee slowly and move forward take your time to move and understand the practice first and then you can add more flow into your practice let's try again with the same arm inhale rotating your left arm from your right rolling your buttocks under lengthening the both sides of the toes so up lifting your heart up arching your back try to look back if possible otherwise look up bend your knee and move forward again very good let's try three more inhale rotate from your right arching your back exhale moving forward inhale rotate from your right exhaling forward one more inhale rotate from your right exhaling forward now let's switch the hand keeping your knee bent now releasing your right hands down right arm shoulder should be relaxed left hands to your hip now inhale start rotating your right arm from your left rolling your buttocks under arching your back exhaling moving forward good inhale arch your back exhale forward inhale arching your back exhale forward beautiful let's try three more inhale arch exhaling forward two more inhale arch exhale forward last one inhale arch do your best exhale forward and now slowly come up have your hands to your hip start rotating your hip again in clockwise direction keep breathing do not hold your breath breathe in and breathe out now anti clockwise rotation all right now from here right foot forward move your left foot to the back moving your both arms behind your back bind your fingers inhale stretching your arms to the back if you are not able to bind your fingers like me then you can use the strap hold the strap in your both hand so after you stretch your arms to the back lifting your heart up and smile with exhalation slowly bending forward towards your front leg as far as the body allows keep lengthening your spine forward moving your chest down and then head down as far your body allows try taking yourself deeper and deeper into the pose let's hold the final position deep breath in and deep breath out very good deep breath in deep breath out deep breath in and deep breath out inhale press your front foot slowly come up exhaling releasing your fingers have your hands back to your hip and step forward let's switch the leg right leg to the back left leg forward move your both hands behind your back bind your fingers inhale stretching your arms to the back rolling your shoulders back and heart up exhale slowly lean forward Keep lengthening your spine forward, moving your chest down. Keep stretching your arms to the back, and release your torso down. Stay. Hold in your final position. Deep breath in, and deep breath out. Deep breath in, deep breath out. 
deep breath in and deep breath out. Inhale, press your front foot and slowly come up. Exhaling, releasing your fingers, turning your both feet in. Now feet is more wider and facing forward. We are moving into Prasarit Padottanasan variation. So move your hands again behind your back, binding your fingers. Inhale, stretching your arms back, lifting your heart up and look out. With nice long exhalation, slowly bend forward. Very good. Get your maximum and hold the pose. Deep breathe in. Deep breathe out. Deep breathe in. Deep breathe out. Deep breathe in. Deep breathe out. Now inhale, press your legs and slowly come up. Releasing your fingers and move your feet in. Right. Now sit down in child pose. Take your time to move. Big toes together and knees are wide open. Look forward, back straight and smile. Inhale. Exhale, walk your hands forward. Do a nice stretch to your back and forehead down. Stay and relax. After taking few calming breaths here, slowly come up. Sit in comfortable seated pose. Have your left palms on outside of your right thigh, moving your right hands behind. We are going to do the twist to relax the back some more. Inhaling, lengthening the spine up. Exhaling, twist to the back. Turning your head to look back. Inhale, coming back to the center. Switch your hands. Right hands outside of your left thigh, moving your left hands to the back. Exhale, lifting your spine up and twist back. Inhale, turning your head back to the center. Move your torso back to the center. Close your eyes. Relaxing your arms and your shoulder. Your back remains straight, sit bone grounded, face muscle relaxed. Bring your awareness to your breath. Feel the flow of your breath from your nose to your belly, from the belly to your nose. Feel the calmness into your breath and peace in your mind. Your body, stay relaxed. Now palms together into the heart center. Gently bow your head. Take a beautiful smile on your face and smile at yourself with all the love and positivity. And gently open your eyes. Raise your head up. Namaste. Thank you.